Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving deep into an important topic UK visa category that allows you to bring dependents. If you have been trying other visa routes without success, then the Temporary Work Charity Worker visa is here for you. Let's break down everything you need to know about this visa, including eligibility, application processes, and lastly, how to bring your dependents with you. Before we delve into the details, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for updates on important immigration news. Now, let's get started. What is the Temporary Work Charity Worker Visa? The Temporary Work Charity Worker Visa is designed for individuals who want to undertake unpaid voluntary work for a charity in the UK. This visa has replaced the previous Temporary Worker Charity Worker Visa T5, streamlining the process for those wishing to contribute to charitable organisations. To be eligible for this visa, you must meet certain criteria. 1. Certificate of Sponsorship You need a certificate of sponsorship from a licensed employer in the UK. This certificate confirms that you will be working for a specific charity and outlines the details of your role. 2. Financial stability. You must prove that you have enough personal savings to support yourself during your stay. Typically, this means having at least £1,270 in your bank account for at least 28 consecutive days prior to your application. 3. Age requirement. You must be 18 years of age or older when you apply. 4. Previous visa restrictions. If you have held a religious worker or charity worker visa in the last year, you cannot apply for this visa unless you can prove you are outside the UK for the entire duration. Now, let's talk about how to apply for the temporary work charity worker visa. 1. Online application. You must submit your application online. You can apply up to three months before your intended start date, as indicated on your certificate of sponsorship. 2. Proving your identity. As part of your application, you'll need to prove your identity. Depending on your nationality and the type of passport you have, this could involve visiting a visa application centre to have your fingerprints and photograph taken or using the UK Immigration ID Check app. 3. Document Submission You'll need to provide several documents including Your Certificate of Sponsorship Reference Number A valid passport or identity document, proof of sufficient personal savings, and tuberculosis TB test results if required based on your country of origin. Once you've applied online and submitted your documents, you can expect a decision on your visa within three weeks if you're applying from outside the UK or eight weeks if you're applying from within the UK. If you need a quicker decision, you may have the option to pay for expedited processing. Now, let's discuss the costs associated with applying for this visa. One. Application fee. The application fee is £298 for each person applying, regardless of whether you're applying from inside or outside the UK. 2. Healthcare surcharge. You'll also need to pay the healthcare surcharge, which is typically £1,035 per year. This fee allows you to access the National Health Service NHS while in the UK. 3. Financial requirements. As mentioned earlier, you need to show that you have at least £1,270 in your personal funds, unless your employer can cover your initial costs. The Temporary Work Charity Worker Visa allows you to stay in the UK for up to 12 months or for the duration specified on your certificate of sponsorship, plus an additional 14 days. You can enter the UK up to 14 days before your job start date. While on this visa, there are specific activities you can and cannot engage in. Here is what you can do. 1. Study in the UK. 
Some courses may require additional approval. 2. Work for your sponsor in the role described in your certificate of sponsorship. 3. Take a second job in the same sector for up to 20 hours per week. 4. Bring eligible dependents, such as your partner and children. The things you cannot do are to receive any payment for work or take on a permanent job. If you wish to bring your partner and children with you, they can apply as your dependents. Here's what you need to know. 1. Eligibility. Your partner can be a spouse, civil partner or an unmarried partner you've lived with for at least two years. Your children must be under 18. 2. Financial requirements. Your partner will need £285 and you'll need £315 for one child, plus £200 for each additional child. 3. Application process. Each family member must complete a separate application and pay the visa fee. They will also need to prove their identity similar to your application process. In summary, the Temporary Work Charity Worker Visa provides a unique opportunity for individuals looking to contribute to the charitable sector in the UK. With the right sponsorship and documentation, you can embark on a meaningful journey of service and support for those in need. Thank you for watching. If you found this information helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon for more updates on immigration and visa related topics. If you have questions or experiences to share, drop them in the comments below, we'd love to hear from you. Take care and see you in the next video.